It's eighth race post time. The eighth from Woodbine is the second 2001 Breeders' Crown Elimination. Three-year-old Colt and Gelding Trot. They're off and trotting. A very even-looking start. Hustled out in the center of the track now goes Liberty Balance. Liberty Balance and Sinatra leaving the most. To their inside, Victory Sam came away in third. Mary Can closing up in fourth. That's Oakley Julian to take in from fifth. Levexter is second to last. And PJ Punjab is going to be the trailer as Liberty Balance takes control of the racetrack. Victory Sam trotted through in second. Mary Can shows up in third. Oakley Julian closing up along the inside in fourth. Sinatra hung out in fifth. Levaxter sixth outside. Then P.J. Punjab. Liberty Balance was at the quarter in a sharp 26 and 3. He's in control on Victory Sam. They trot past three-eighths of the mile. Racing along the inside is Ameri Can from third. Four more lengths to Oakley. Julian a hold to close from fourth. Levaxter is overland from fifth. Sinatra sixth on the inside and brought out was P.J. Punjab from the rear of the field. Liberty Balance on top by two past the half in 57 seconds. 30 and two-fifths rating in the second quarter. He takes him into the final turn. Waples rating well the speed of this one. Liberty balance just over three-eighths of the mile to go. Lovexter mostly overland is grinding away on the outside of Victory Sam. Ameri Can following up in fourth. P.J. Punjab second over from fifth. Oakley Julian held in reserve. Sixth at the inside and Sinatra is trailing at head stretch. Liberty balance superior. Down to three-quarters by two lengths on Victory Sam. One 26 and 4. Three quarter time and Liberty Balance had a middle half of a minute and one fifth from the quarter to three quarters, but Victory Sam has a peak to his outside and Liberty Balance picks it up again into the final eighth of the mile. In the second, Breeders' Crown Elimination over Victory Sam brought out as a mare I can. Liberty Balance comes to the wire with Waples offering no urging to win the second Breeders' Crown Elimination over a mare I can. Victory Sam third. Oakley Julian was fourth. Levexter fifth. Liberty Balance in 155. His win streak now at six in a row. The multiple gold series champion in Ontario wins his 2001 Breeders' Crown elimination. Liberty Balance. Balanced image three-year-old Bay Gelding from Victory Girl. Owned by Elizabeth and Thomas Rankin of St. Catharines. Trained by Pat Hunt and driven to victory by Randall Waples. Also 9-14 and 14 this year and a life's mark in his Breeders' Crown Elimination. Liberty Balance. There's, not, there's hardly any wind out there and the track's really good. We've seen some big miles tonight, so that was very handy for him. Uh, do you believe in such a thing as a uh, home field advantage, a horse that's familiar uh, with most of the tracks here in Ontario and here at Woodbine? Uh, you buy into that at all? Oh, I think so. I think it's a big advantage no matter what sport you're in. It's always nice to be in the home field advantage, you know, and when he goes into the retention barn, he's been there before. He knows what it's all about. You know, when he, dr when he comes into the paddock or the grounds, he's been here before, so it's nothing really new to him. He goes through the tunnel before, you know. He, he's pretty well used to it now, so I, I definitely think there is a sort of home field advantage. Okay, we just had another look at the stretch drive. Uh, his lead was diminishing at the wire. Was he being shut down or, or was he all out? He was being conserved. <laughs> hopefully, anyway, hopefully the, it'll pay off next week, you know, because 55 was a big mile, you know, and uh, he, he was being conserved. All right, next week you'll hook up with SJ's Caviar in the final. Uh, you have to be looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to it, you know, but, I mean, it w certainly wouldn't have disappointed me if SJ's Caviar didn't make it in his elimination. You know, he's a tough horse to beat, you know. So, uh, but, I mean, you know, the, the Mr. and Mrs. Rankin, you know, they put up big money for this horse to race in this race, and they deserve, uh, you know, a real good shot at them. I think he's a great colt, and I think he's every bit as good as anything out there. So next week we'll see. Okay, we will indeed. Good luck. <laughs> Pray to God for a good post position too, okay, Greg? Thanks. All right, that's Randy Waples, winning driver with Liberty Balance, taking tonight's second limb for three-year-old Colt Trot.